Hey guys, I'm just doing a quick video showing what I'm trying to do to get the uh, Touch OSC app on my iPhone 4S working with the Total Mix FX. I have a laptop here, an Acer Aspire, just an older one, but I wiped it, started from scratch with Windows 7 Professional 64-bit. I've set up just the basic drivers for the uh, laptop itself. I have an RME Fireface UFX plugged in with the what I believe is the latest driver from the RME website. I have uh, the Touch OSC app on my phone. I've downloaded the uh, the layout, the Total Mix phone. I believe Matt's Helgeson. That's uh, who made it. Thank you very much, Matt's. Hope I didn't pronounce your name too incorrectly. Um, so that's the layout I am trying to use. Uh, I have communication already. I'm on the same Wi-Fi as with this as with the laptop. I have gone into the options and settings, already checking here with my settings that going into the OSC on my phone and the IP remote here matches up with what I've got on my phone. Local IP is 101, the last digits, which are now I put them in there on the OSC panel. Um, host matches up with the laptop. Incoming or sorry, outgoing is 9001 just like on the laptop, incoming 7001. So, going to enable OSC on the laptop. Go back out of here on my phone. And the phone tries to send data. You can see the uh, green symbol up here flashing away. But there's no red indicating anything's being received back from the computer and when I move anything on the screen nothing happens either coming back to the phone. Now to show that I have communication between the phone and my computer I've downloaded from the Hexlar web website for the Touch OSC app I've downloaded the Touch OSC bridge I've installed it I have it running and I'm going to use it to I'm going to disable OSC control on the laptop enable MIDI control. I've already gone into settings and set the MIDI in and out to the Touch OSC bridge. So the Touch OSC bridge is now the MIDI in and out. The channels get their symbols appearing like if it's being controlled by a Mackie capable device or I think that's the protocol, Mackie protocol. Now on this I made just very simple, I made a very simple layout with the Touch OSC editor, just eight mute buttons. When I go to sync, and it's sending the uh, layout, like just broadcasting it through Wi-Fi. If I, oops, go to layout, and just for the fun, I'm going to remove the one I have here. Uh, I'm not sure if it's showing up. One sec, I'm going to focus again. Okay, when I go to add, there's my laptop showing, you know, like it's an available waiting to send a template. I click on it, press on it rather, and there it is, eight mutes. That's the one I created. I will select it. I'll just stop the sync on my laptop. Go back to the total mix, and I'll go back into here under MIDI bridge, turn it on. Again, the Aspire appears in the list. Hit done. And there, mute is appearing on the laptop. I assume it's, you know, if, if buttons are already lit up mute on the screen, they don't appear right away on this. I don't know if that's something I can change, but it's not a big deal. Uh, but yeah, it's speaking. If I press mute one on there, on the screen itself, uh, laptop, yep, yeah, it happens. Red's flashing away like it's receiving data. Green flashes when I send data. So there's definitely communication in MIDI between the la phone and the laptop, but for whatever reason, I can't get OSC to work. So... Not sure if anyone sees something obvious that I'm missing in the setup. If you have any suggestions, please let me know.